Welcome football fans to this beautiful sunny evening here where the air is thick with anticipation and excitement. You're tuned in to FQ TV's live coverage of the highly anticipated NPL clash between the formidable Olympic FC and the Roaring Lions Football Club. Well, this is one of the great rivalries in the NPL era and we are here at Goodwin Park a cornerstone of the Brisbane football community and one that has been the stage of many thrilling footballing dramas. In this matchup, it's Olympic. They take on to the pitch with their spirits high following recent victory against 10-man Redlands United and that hard-fought draw on opening day against Morton City Excelsior. Their form is a testament to their great determination and they'll need that this evening on the other side we have Lions Football Club they have been excellent in the opening two games with an, an impressive form their recent triumphs against Peninsula Power and last time out against 10-man Rochdale Rovers have set the stage for what promises to be an epic showdown well Pengeli and Ryderton the Lions have been making waves in those opening two games. Pengeli has been on fine form with his sharp shooting skills already netting two goals in the first two league games, boasting a 50% shot accuracy. It's Olympic all eyes really are on the back line with Leck and Lugo on goals. Leck has been immovable at times at the back, thwarting attacks and Lugo, his leadership and goalkeeping ability really fortifies Olympic's backline and he keeps them calm under a lot of pressure and that may be key if they are to get a result today. With Olympic scoring four goals and Lions six and those two rounds were set for a thrilling battle of attacking football. Well, the players are ready. My name is Alan Crowell, so stay tuned as we bring you all the action from this Queensland NPL showdown Olympic FC and Lions. It will be the home sides that will get us off and running. As we await the whistle from the man in the middle. Lions wearing their away white jerseys and Olympic with that famous red home kit. And we'll see if they can get off to a fast start. Lions scoring just inside the first minute last week An absolute peach of a goal from the skipper Duckworth Lions will be hoping of more the same here at home early on Olympic trying to go along to sort of force the issue they have been very quick from back to front on the attacking phase of play Lions have been a little bit the opposite, happy to play the ball around at the back and make their way forward. Olympic will have Wolves and Gold Coast Knights next. After these games, Gold Coast Knights losing 1-0 last time out. Yesterday to Peninsula Power. They opened the league table already, two, two games in. 
He's low by rim here for Lions though. There's a delivery towards the back post. It's thundered back across by Hart Phillips. Still a chance though. Looking for some support. Olympic thought they did enough, but it is a, it's a corner kick to the Lions. They are looking for a fast start. Rydenton coming across to take this one for the away side. Here's Matthew Rydenton. There's a New Zealander to take. Here's a corner. It's a decent one. Olympic don't properly clear it. Scaroni helps it on. Olympic might be able to break. Thompson King ran into a little bit of trouble there. Skinner coming off best. There's Thompson King again battling for it. There's Sono, the former Suffers Paradise Apollo midfielder. Very exciting signing for Olympic. Player that dominated in the FQPL one last season. I'll think through here as Maud for a bit of support. Looks back into Sono. Sono looking for the one two, but just not quite on the save wavelength there. And Jared happy to see that one go out for a goal kick. There's Ramzani. With him, took a little bit of a heavy touch as Maud tried to come in to pounce on it. Nice skin up. Back to Beagley. He's with them again. Broderick. There's Jared, Ramzani. Ramzani going for the long diagonal ball. And, and Ticknap was the target, but it was all the way through for a goal kick. Well, that's been an exciting card of NPL action this weekend. Gold Coast United beating Brisbane City and that fantastic win for Peninsula Power over Gold Coast Knights, both Gold Coast sides Losing out. Here's in Ticknip. And Yelly looking for the foul there, but it's Fender's back with Lugo. Now Driver. Oh, just to pass the pass to Sono wasn't quite on target. Lions have it back. Well, based on how we know Lions like to play, we can probably tell that they might have the lion's share of the of possession today. Olympic are usually fast at the traps and like to get the park, park quickly. There's Skinner using his body well and does win the foul. Decent area as well for Lions. Skinner trying to take that quickly as Hart Phillips was in a little bit of room but a bit of smart behaviour there from Olympic. Keeping the game slow. Here's the free kick opportunity now for Lions. Probably from this range it will be a delivery into the box. It does go exactly there, but it's all the way through to Lugo. Keeps that under control for Olympic. There is Sono. Over the top, no space for Avis back in towards Sono. Sono fires it across. And Skinner will look to try and break. Skinner does really well, in fact. And now Lions can maybe break here with numbers. They're rampaging forward. Here's McDonald's. There are a couple of options. McDonald's tried to find Broderick. 
Broderick fires it across, big save from Lugo. And that's the risk you take against the Lions. Olympic make the mistake, and they break so quickly as well. And Maud trying to force it through Davis, but picked up again from the Lions. It is Duckworth. Aramzani. There's Jared. Back to Ramzani. There's a long diagonal again up to Pengeli, and it might fall for the volley opportunity. And the shot firing over from McDonald. A decent long diagonal. Actually, fell nicely for him. No one tracking. McDonald at all there at all. The time to take a shot. Eagerly trying to put a bit of pressure on him. Might have just put him off. His driver. Avis. Lovely little layoff now. And it's Leck breaking forward. Leck. Avis has it back. Tries to cut inside, but strong defending. From the Lions, Broderick. Beagley, Scaroni, Thompson King. There's a long ball out wide, a little bit of space now there from Avis, but he's just drifted into the offside position. Here's Ramzani. Skips away from Mould. Play here. Again, it's Broderick. Broderick floats that one in, but it's just a little bit over hit. And here's Hart Phillips. Back with Duckworth. Duckworth trying to sneak that one through to Skinner. always been a competitive fixture when these two sides meet but in the last five matches Lions have come out on top four times Lions picking that one up and high up the park and take that Ramzani and now Skinner Skinner looking to take on Sono Dono gets a tackle in, the referee just giving a foul there. It's a very good area for the Lions. It's Fridenton to take it as well. Ranton floats that in, it's a really good ball into the box. And Pengeli with the opportunity. It was whipped in with some amount of venom and it just really needed a touch. Pengeli was there. He was inches away to opening the scoring here at Goodwin Park. Like a bit of a heavy touch. Lions really not letting Olympic get out the half very easily. What a high press and they've given it away in the middle of the park now. And this is an opportunity for Olympic driving forward. They've played across. What a chance that was for Olympic. Breaking with pace. Ravis has had to pick someone out and in the end just a poor ball in there straight. To Pond and goals, Ramzani fouled there. A little bit of frustration from Olympic. Not the type of chance that you'd expect him to do better with. There's Jared into Duckworth. 
Really well done by Scaroni. And again, here's Avis. Avis driving again. Another opportunity here. A couple of numbers forward. Can he play it in? It's not a very good ball again here. But Leck has it. Right, Thompson King. Right to Maud, back into Scaroni. Thompson King again using Sono. Back with him. Olympic lines forcing Olympic back. Monday. Lovely turn there again by Leck. Leck squeezing it through here. Avis tries to check back onto that right peg. Right Lions again mopping up. There's Broderick. Duckworth. And it's Hart Phillips. Using Skinner. Skinner checking back inside. Needs the help. Offered. No, it's Jared. Olympic getting right back into the shape so quickly. It's allowing Lions to have possession. And McDonald looks inside. Broderick. Broderick looking for the run from McDonald, but forced to go back. Broderick frustrated. Yeah, McDonald. Now it is Jared again. Ramzani. Ticknip. It's inside to Duckworth, just a little bit over hit. And Scaroni. Thumped away by Olympic. Ramzani has all the time in the world to bring that one back. Rydington. There's McDonald. One back though, Thompson King. Switches it out. Again to Avis. Now here's Mould. Mould. Left foot. Ball into the box. And Ramzani forced to clear. A little bit better there from Olympic. In that final third. Speedway to take the throw. And Monday. Out to Monday. Now the driver. To Mould. Scrawny dinks it over the top. Madley, but Madley drifting offside. Now Broderick. Broderick trying to win a corner, but in the end it does go out for a goal kick. Both sides just trying to feel each other out. Already tell Lions really looking to get the ball back as soon as they lose it and win it back quickly as possible. Olympic. Get back into the shape quickly. That ball just drifting out. There's Jared to Ramzani. Back with Jared. Broderick. Donald turning into trouble. Good goal for Olympic throw. There's Avis. Avis just looked like he knocked that out, but the referee throws it to the Lions. Bigley, lovely turn from Madley. 
And he might have won a free kick now, the referee. In the end, said that that was all ball. Great catch that one back there from Beagley's foot. Are they doing really well? Did look like Gerard did get the ball there. And 15 minutes played. Here at Goodwin Park. Still nil nil. Lions probably just having the better chances, but outside of a chance from Pengeli. Have been a little bit short of goal scoring action or goal mouth action. Now right, here's Leck. Madly. Nice Scaroni. This is better from Olympic. Davis just drifting a little bit offside position. There's Scaroni. Back with Driver. Nice Sono. Driver again. Okay, right. Nicely done here. Nicely worked there, Leck. Able to drive forward a little bit now. Now it's Maud. Back with Leck. Leck into Madley. Leck wants it back, tries to drift it in. Plains of a handball there for Ramzani. And the referee has picked up on it. And it is a penalty kick here for Olympic. Might catch this one again here from the angle. Leck drifting in, tries to chip it into the box. Ramzani definitely handling it. And it is the penalty kick chance for Olympic. He'll be taking it, looks like it will be Leck to take it. It is Lick to step up here to fire Olympic in front at home against the Lions. This would be a massive start. It's Lick against Pond. Saved by Pond. Goes down nicely. It was a good height for the keeper. He guesses the right way. It's a wonderful save from Pond. And he keeps the scores level. What a save that might be in this match. But one of those ones that if he beats the keeper there, you say it's a good penalty. But Pond does really well to save it. There's a the delivery. Subs up towards Sono with a volley and he fires over. And will Olympic rue that chance at the spot? Sono usually good from that type of range. He's under a lot of pressure. Well, is that a let off for the Lions? Big save by Pond. Here's Hart Phillips. Pace beyond Sono, Hart Phillips. Driving in and again. They do pick it up, Scaroni. Just knocking that out of the play. Ramzani. Rydinton. There's Duckworth. Skinner. Skinner surely fouled there. It's a good challenge on Skinner. He will be very dangerous. The Lions out in that left side. Very good on his left side and on his right side. Dangerous player. Play against.
Here is Thompson King. Don't really have many options ahead of him. Comes back to him, Thompson King. And he'll lack a few players on him, but Lions do enough to defend. Here's Pond. Just gets it back to Ramzani. Here's Broderick. Back to Jared. No, Raiderton. And a Duckworth. Is inside to Ticknip. Fancies a shot from there. And that goes well over the bar. Best of shots to hear from Ticknip. Usually much better from that range. Well, 22 minutes played here at Goodwin Park. Still nil nil. Big save from Pond to keep the scores level. sure you like and subscribe on the Facebook pages or YouTube channel wherever you are watching this evening thank you so much for joining us uh, thrilling crash of two of the heavyweights in the division here's Hart Phillips here's Skinner he's back with him and that will a little Olympic to push a little bit up the park. Here's Duckworth. Skinner. Nicely worked by Lyons again. Into Intignip. It's given right back to the Lions too. Here's Skinner, a ton shot. And saved nicely. By Lugo and goals. Straight down the throat by Skinner. Picked up high up the park too. Lions have it again with Skinner. Looking for the overlap here. A decent delivery. Goes all the way back through to Broderick. And it's Broderick now. Support offered by McDonald. Duckworth. There's Hart Phillips. Skinner. Skinner looking back. Still with Skinner. I think across towards McDonald. Well defended back by Madley. Striker getting back to defend too. The Olympic now like look to break here. Madley again. Davis. Driver has it. Lions working so hard to try and get the ball back. The moment they lose possession. It's really dangerous pass it from Lugo. Lions working hard though, Scaroni. Olympic really trying hard to get out the park, madly chasing that down. Lions playing with such a fluid formation. Now here is McDonald. Fine pass on McDonald too. He's back with him. Shifts it out to Hart Phillips and Ticknip. Now Duckworth. Lions really trying to work it into the box. Duckworth looking for the one two. He gets it back here as a captain. Nice to force it in. It might come back to him. So no. Olympic working hard to get out. Avis takes a heavy touch. Strong challenge coming in from Jared. Again, Olympic have it. Poor pass there. Trying to find Madley, but he just drifted offside. Olympic trying to transition quickly from back to front when they do get possession, but hasn't been able to work as yet. The Lions having a huge share of possession here at Goodwin Park. Here's Ramzani. And now Jared. Back with the centre half, Duckworth, Jared again. There's Broderick. Here's 
Little dink over the top here. Skinner and Rim now. A little bit of space here for Skinner. McDonald's there as an option. McDonald plays it in. Time to turn and shoot. There was Broderick and Olympic just getting back. Olympic not surprisingly just clearing the lines and now Ramzani has had a lot of the ball. Here at Goodwin Park, Duckworth. Trying to squeeze it in, not quite coming off. Ball tries to clear it, here's Pengeli. He floats it in, it's just a little bit over the head of Broderick. Olympic coming up the park, mad late, giving it straight back to the Lions. Now Jared Duckworth with all the time in the world. Pengeli. And Tignip. Is the offer there yeah, from Jackson Hart Phillips. And Duckworth. Pulls it in, Skinner and loads the room. And a left foot strike. Wasn't hit with any conviction. Just sort of snatched at it. Well played from Lions. Good movement from Skinner drifting into that space. Takes one touch, but the second one. Very difficult. Very difficult technique to master. Gilly was the target. That looked like a rough challenge there by Scaroni. Claims of a high foot. He does get the ball, but it's one of those ones now with to be careful about endangering an opponent. Did have his studs up, the referee. Not awarding a card either. Nothing in it, just a free kick to the Lions. There's Redenton standing over there with the right foot again. It's probably just a wee bit too far out to have a crack at goal, but might just be a delivery. It is a delivery, is headed away by Leck. And knocked back in again, cleared. Avis just knocking it down the line. There's no one there, he's just trying to relieve a bit of pressure. Well, with McDonald. Really defending well. Mavis. And Thompson King. Mavis again with it back. Go for a Lions throw with a sliding challenge coming by this Captain Duckworth. Possession back for Lions. Here is McDonald. Switch a play to Ramzani. There's Hart Phillips. Nice Skinner with a little bit of green to run into. Skinner gets past the first challenge. Plays it across, comes off driver. And right back towards the keeper. Tell you, that would have been some goal. Came right off Scaroni. Skinner does really well drifting past the challenge. Plays it across. Tell you, that would have been something if that had gone past Lugo and goals. He's mad late in towards Jack Thompson King, but the two not in the same wavelength and possession back with Lions. So far, two sides. They've done well. The goal scoring charts so far yet to find a way to goal. Here's Skinner. Skinner losing out to Sono. Inside to Lech. Lech forced back towards his keeper. Back to Maud here. Now Scaroni. Maud playing it up towards Madley as he tries to find Sono, but again. Lions just crowding them out. And here's Jared. Well, 
The Lions have always been at the forefront of football in Queensland. They've won premierships and grand finals. Which they did win the 2020 edition after beating Olympic. Olympic. Just a one championship to their name. It's always been a very competitive fixture and the opening half hour has been no different. Here's Scaroni. Scaroni turns Pingeli. Plains Thompson King. Avery looking for some support. He needed Avis to come short to a system Olympic. Haven't been able to hold on to the ball for long. As expected, they are trying to break forward, break quickly when Lions give up possession. But they're going straight back into that defensive shape as soon as they lose the ball. There's Jared Ramzani. Redenton, Ramzani again. Uh -huh. well, Skinner. Good chance here at the free kick, the delivery from Duckworth. Was a good one, but again, Olympic thump it away. Ramzani. Duckworth. Olympic tried to press a little bit, but they might be caught out again here. And take nip. And now Broderick. Broderick just delays. And back inside and Avis clears. Nice sono. To Lek. We're now here for Maud. Sono on the edge of the area. Sono into Madley. Madley cut it out. Here's Avis. Now Leck. Back with Scaroni. And it's Beagley. Avis. Jackson King was a target. Just couldn't quite get it under control. Is Scaroni under a bit of pressure, but comes off best. Here's Scaroni. Fancies a shot. Goes high wide and not at all handsome. Been able to hit the target there. Not really one for the highlight reel at all. Just tends to a little bit of frustration from the Olympic side. Here's Ramzani. Redenton. Jared. Towards Broderick. Broderick skins his man, gets away from Avis. Broderick still going. Just back onto that left foot. Broderick He's trying to get on his right. Broderick still going. And a good bit of defending. And it's timed out for a corner here.
And it's Redenton to take this corner. Opportunity for the away side. There's the right foot delivery. And it was a free header really for Jared, but he couldn't direct it goalwards. Help back in. And knocked round for another corner from Maud. Here's Redenton to take. There's a real chance here for Jared too at that corner. He couldn't quite direct his head goalwards. Redenton to take, not the best of deliveries. Knocked back in. Redenton, pressure on Lugo, but he does really, really well. His driver, going back to Lugo. Here's Mundy. Thompson King, tons Duckworth. Here is Thompson King. And out towards Leck. Scaroni. Back with him. Scaroni again. Ton by Leck. Nicely done here. And Olympic. They've worked this well. Like opting to hold on to possession rather than trying to force something through. It is with Mundy. Davis asking a hell of a lot there of Thompson King. Pon just knocks up the park. Sono brings that under control. Nice touch from Sono. Now here's Leck. Leck shoots. Saved by Pond and goals. Not a bad attempt there from Leck. Straight down the throat though of Pond and he'll be hoping they all come like that. Scaroni on uh, Monday his driver now Scaroni again Sono one pick trying to work it well Well, you have to go back to the 3rd of September in 2022 for Olympic's last win in this fixture. It's a 3-2 victory away from home at Luxury Paint Stadium. There's Skinner. And Tickner. Now McDonald. Redenton. Jared Ramzani Mark Phillips into Skinner Ramzani again Ramzani drifting forward finds Skinner and a little bit of room the ball deflects through goes back to Skinner Redenton Adrian Denton again. Jared and Ramzani. It's a crossfield ball. Trying to find some room down this side. Broderick. Has to be a little bit quicker from the lines when they do shift it from left to right, right to left. There's Ramzani. Skinner. Olympic defend well. Now here is Thompson King. Try and break quickly, but well defended from Ramzani. Skinner loses out though to Sono. Thompson King to Leck. Leck shifted more into more of a midfield role. There's Mundy. Back to Lugo. And Driver. Bring it forward. Madly trying to turn. He's. Andy was fouled. Davis chasing that one down. He does really well. 
He gets away from McDonald here. He's driving forward. He tries to squeeze it through. Madley going for it. I think it might have gone for a goal kick. It has. A good ball through from Davis. Claims of a penalty there from the crowd, but not off on it. Madley wasn't claiming for it either. That's usually when you can tell there's not, not an awful lot in it. Here's Ramzani. Matt Phillips trying to squeeze it through. Might have drifted offside. He has. more NPL action next weekend with very exciting fixtures as Ryan gets kicked off with Morton Bay Excelsior taking on Brisbane City Olympic will face Wolves next and the Queensland Lions take on the Brisbane Roar next week as well that there's the last remaining fixture on the Sunday. There's Ramzani. Now to Jared. Jutan back with Duckworth. Blocked off Jackson King and like fighting hard for it. Side. He might have got a foul there, the referee will play the advantage, he has done. And yet another opportunity. It's going to look to be in a little bit of pain as well. He'll be used to that with a play of his ability. There's Duckworth standing over this one with Redenton. Right on the half time whistle. Will the Lions work something here? Redenton. There's a delivery in. It is headed towards goal and it's just a whisker away. Big opportunity again for the Lions. That was a much better delivery. And the header there from Broderick. Or Pengeli rather, not hitting the target. He hits the target, he scores. I wonder how much of additional time will we have here. As the referee does blow the half-time whistle. Not surprisingly, it was a closely fought match here. The Lions having loads of possession, trying to break down this Olympic side. But at halftime, here at Goodwin Park, it's Olympic nil, Lions nil. The Matildas are on fire. And the Socceroos have the breakthrough.
one stays off. Belton Industries is proud to be the official shelter and grandstands partner of Football Queensland. Felton offers a range of premium aluminium grandstands, from elite portable spectator seating to soccer team shelters for players and coaches. Give your fans the best view of the game with Felton's comfortable spectator seating. With sun safe shelters or powder coated in your team colours, Whatever your club needs, Felton has a high quality, low maintenance seating option to suit. We are the pioneers in Australian made grandstands and team shelters. Contact Felton today on 1800 834 016 or visit felton.net.au.
welcome back for the second 45 minutes here at Goodwin Park. It is Olympic FC nil, Lions nil still. Here, yeah, big second 45. Here, yeah, live on FQTV. Until the results of the round, the Lions could go top of the table for result today, and they would be the only team to win three from three. Currently, leaders Morton Bay Excelsior with the two wins and a draw. And the Lions continue their form here. A will Olympic be able to cause a bit of a shock on the basis of the way the game's gone so far. Olympic have defended really well and they have limited the Lions' chances, but they may rue that missed penalty from Leck. Lions are looking to start fast here. Here's Roderick. Out to Hart Phillips. Now Skinner. Skinner back inside to Broderick. Referee playing the advantage push play there. The ball from Duckworth. is a really good ball out wide here. McDonald plays it in. There's a shot. There's tons of room. And it is a fast start from Broderick. And the Lions strike first. 50 seconds played of the second half. And Luke Broderick fires the wayside in front. And that will probably throw out the tactics of the second half from Olympic. He scored two goals last season and he's off and running this season. Exactly the start the Lions were desperate to have in the second half. They scored so early last week in the first 45. And they've scored early here in the second 45. Well, it'll be intriguing to see how the Lions go now. Will they continue to sit in as they have done? Or will they be a little bit more braver in doing so? That may present more space. The Lions, I think Broderick couldn't believe how much space and time he had just in front of Lugo to put that one away. Here's Ramzani. Driving forward is McDonald. Trying to see right foot delivery, it's a good delivery, no. Straight at Lugo. Here's Maud. They cried it out. Thompson King. Swings that off Skinner. It's surprising he's actually given that. Referee gave that one to the Lions. The advice of his assistant referee. And now there's a pass from Tinknap. Inside, taking up again, looking back in. Pangeli with a layoff, thumped away from driver. The Lions certainly in the mood in this second half. Taking up Pangeli, McDonald was out to Leck. Avis plays forward. A poor touch there in from Avis. Leck rather. Now Pangeli. And all the way back to the keeper under pressure. Pon to Ramzani. Denton over the top. Skinner manages to win it here. And the turn there from Tickmip. And it is a free kick in a very good area for the Lions. Ticknip doing brilliantly to win that foul. There's Redenton to take. A 
A little bit of a tight angle to go for goal. It will most likely be a delivery. Here's Redenton. Hits the wall. And this Skinner lays it back. Kevin Hart Phillips. He's back with the Lions though. Here is Intinknip. Now McDonald. Squeezing through back to Intinknip. The Skinner trying to find the room to shoot. Spilled by Lugo, but he gets it on a second attempt. See the Lions having bulk of possession and chances. Olympic not really able to get out there on half at all. In the first five minutes of the second half, it has been all Lions. Here's Ramzani. Now Pond. Just gone over the head of Sono, but kept in by Skinner. And Hart Phillips. Ramzani. Runs into the space. Redenton. And now Skinner. Challenge there by Thompson King. There's Jared Ramzani. Back with Jared. Redenton wants it, he has it. There's a 1 2 now, but it's just a wee bit overhit. Quickly, I'll see that one out. Through there by Thompson King now, and a little bit of room. Davis again on this left side, asking a lot of Sono. Try to play it early inside, so not just not quite able to get onto it. Olympic now venturing forward, chance at the throw. Eagley, Leck, Eagley has it again, back with Leck, and here's Sono. Sono battling to win it. But Lines clear. Maud knocks it back, but giving it straight to Ramzani, and he's got a little bit of space to run into. He opts to go for the long diagonal, and it's an absolute peach of a pass here. Way back to Pengeli. It might come though to Skinner. Skinner's got Duckworth. Skinner tries to go himself, and it's cleared away. McDonald wins it back off Lick. McDonald. And now to Duckworth. Ramzani. There's Skinner. Picked up though by Sono. Looks inside to Leck. Thompson King. Scaroni. Eagle out wide. Avis. Scaroni. This is Monday. Needs a help offered by Lugo. And it's Driver. A little bit of room for Thompson King and Sono. Sono can be very dangerous in this position if he can get running, but he opts to come back inside. Monday. Avis trying to take on his man this time. Tries to open his left foot, but doesn't get enough around it. And it just goes out for a goal kick. It's the best passage of play from Olympic in the second half. And probably will feel a little bit frustrated. Didn't make anything of it. The Lions can really read that Davis looks to always try and check back onto that right foot. That time he tried to use his left, but nothing comes of it. Left a little bit of quality. There's 
Takpos, great pass to Skinner, he helps it back in towards the box, controlled well by Ticknip, but he tried to win the corner. Here's Scaroni. Davis back inside. Black does really well, but he's just beaten there. And he does actually win a foul as well. McDonald. Foul there, just lines now. Looking for that all important second goal right now. As things stand, they are the only side in the division to win three from three. It's taken short. Space now there. Broderick plays it across. Davis trying to break quickly. Adley. Davis just delaying the pass. It's going to be a little bit quicker from the winger. Here's Beagley. A bit quick to give it back to the Lions. And then Hart Phillips. Hart Phillips cuts inside. Comes out to Skinner now. Now he's in Ticknip. Skinner making the overlapping run. The room now here for Redenton. He'll fancy it. Blocked by Thompson King. Now Madley. Putting on for blister and pace, but does really well. And communication breakdown from Avis and Thompson King. And they did have numbers breaking forward there, Olympic. Redenton. And Tignip. Mark Phillips. Back to Skinner. Still with Skinner. Redenton. Roderick. The ball does get floated in towards Pengeli. They go out to collect. One ball looking for Madley, but it's it is well defended by the Lions. It is Duckworth. Ramzani. Duckworth again, Ramzani. To the Olympic half, Ramzani drifted to find some room and he runs into trouble. Sono and I, Olympic try and break quickly, but the captain is there to defend for the Lions. Duckworth intercepts McDonald. Right now, here's Tignip is back to Duckworth. Roderick. There's Jared. He's all the way back to Pon Ramzani. Here once more. And Hart Phillips. Phillips again. It probably came off him. Well, if you just join us live on FQ TV. It is the Lions who lead the goal just 50 seconds into the second half. Goal from Broderick. Olympic missing a penalty after 18 minutes. Olympic making a change here as Avis does come off and he is replaced with Dunn. That is a positive change for Olympic. you like and subscribe if you're watching on Facebook or YouTube and 
to more NPL action coming next week. Big games for both Olympic and the Lions. Lions face off against Brisbane Raw and Olympic away to Wolves. Newly promoted Wolves. Duckworth. Ball through there by Sono. Ramzani picking that one up. There's a foul just on Ramzani. Just off the ball. Here's a one pick trying to make something happen there. Dunn just trying to make some space. The shot straight at the keeper. Got it. Got it. There's Redenton. Still with Redenton. Uh, Duckworth. Just unable to keep that one in. Confirmation of uh, substitution by the Lions as Skinner, who has been excellent, has made way. And it's Fichtner has replaced him, number seven, for the Lions. Let's be a late one. It's actually gone Olympics' way. Frustration there from the Olympic players as the challenge was made. The Lions midfield, the referee. Looks like he's changed his mind, possibly. Calling on the physio. Well, you have expected the Lions to go on and maybe score two or three after scoring so early in the half, but they haven't really been able to muster up any other big moments in the game since since going ahead. Olympic have. They got back into their shape well and kept their head up. was a 
challenge. The referee has changed his mind and confirmation of the yellow card late tackle from McDonald. Here's Leck. Out now. Maud finds Sonos only quickly. Trying to pick out Thompson King. Again, playing it in. Sonos in space. He leads it back across the shot. Saved there on the line. Leck was there. Better from the Lions. It was Brindle South who made the block, a substitute. Olympics tails are up a little here. Here's a right foot delivery. It was knocked away. Held back into the danger area. Up was fighting for it. Ramzani thumps it to safety. Scaroni turns well, Leck here. Leck loses the ball, Duckworth picks it up. Trying to squeeze it through to Flitchnut. Scaroni. And he fouled. One pick up to take that one quickly. Here's Leck. And Scaroni. Back with Scaroni. Here's Thompson King, this is better from Olympic and his you know, fashion commentator curses. And they give it straight back to Lions. The Lions look to try and play it through. Now here's Fichner. Options to his left and right. He might fancy a shot on his own. And that shot scuffers wide of the mark. The Lions well worthy of their lead so far in the game. They've been Arguably the better side, the Lions had the most chances, but Olympic really defending well, keeping their shape well. And they try and break forward a little bit themselves. Midway through the second half. In his pond, Amzani. Back with Pond. It's Hart Phillips trying to squeeze it through. Driver coming across and doing relatively well. Maud wins the, <laughs> the goal kick, but you don't want to mess around with it too much there. Lions working extremely hard to regain possession as high up the park as possible. And pick up to go direct. Hardly drifting in offside position. It's a lovely flick from Pengeli. The layoff has really well worked here. And it's fired off the post there. A big opportunity from Broderick. That was really well worked from the Lions. Pengeli, Redenton all involved. It came out to Broderick. And a shot cannon off the post. Right back off Lugo. And so unlucky. It goes out for a corner as the Lions look to go two goals to the good here. Redenton to take this corner. There's the right foot delivery towards that near post. It's cleared away from Thompson King. Redenton will have a second bite at this delivery. That's really, really deep. Tinkman. And Gilly tries to squeeze it. The shot straight at Lugo under the pressure from Olympic as they try and break quickly themselves. It is done. Dunn just gives it right back to the Lions. 
Wasn't really much else he could have done there under that much pressure. Ball towards Pengeli, drivers there. Beagley looking for the one two with Thompson King. Beagley again. Beagley. Now Dunn. Beagley trying his best to find Dunn, but this pond. Um, for much of the first half and so far in the second half Olympic haven't been able to get their attacking players in the game high up the park no, working extremely hard the referee should pull that for a foul he does line set piece expert and Denton to float that in and it is easily collected by Lugo and the Olympic be able to break here Maud and Sono and he can't quite bring it under control it hasn't really been his afternoon and with that that looks like it will be Sono's last involvement of the day. There's Ramzani. Now done. Back with Monday. Shot whisked over the bar. <laughs> a fantastic strike. And it almost caught Pond off guard. Positive changes from Olympic as they try and look to get back in this game. De Vita coming on the park. Jankovic as well. Playing inside to Jankovic. Touch there from Devita. Devita driving forward now. Got lots of options to his right. He tries to force it through towards Dunn. Probably not the best. Blue goal. Scaroni. Here's driver to Mundy. Back with him. Jankovic. Now Monday again. Back with Lugo. Looking for Thompson King. It's picked up though from De Vita. De Vita does well to hold it up. Lots of room here. Jankovic. 
a bit of a short pass from Jankovic and it looks like it might be a free kick there from Brind off Brindle South on Dunn Brindle South claiming a lick Brindle South claiming that a lick gets in front of him and it's just on the edge of the box here and De Vita is just on and he's standing over it along with Lick and Lick opting to take it right on the edge of the area definitely favours the right foot if he does go for goal it's always very difficult to get it up and over from this far out but I'm sure he'll give it a go 75 minutes on the clock it is Lick gets it up and not just didn't get enough dip on it, goes wide of the mark. Decent attempt from the range. But 75 minutes gone here. At Goodwin Park, Olympic, a goal behind. Lions looking to go three from three in the league. Loaded in here and it's controlled by Lick and he tries to cut back on his left foot. But Ramzani there. Strong defending by the centre half. Lions look to try and come forward quickly but it's picked up. By Maud Olympic having their best spell of the day really. They have to make something happen with it. Here's Scaroni. Maud again Maud just getting a little bit frustrated and making the foul and also getting a yellow card of Broderick <laughs> 15 minutes left to play all the lines hold out. Thankful time from Redentin, but he gives it away to Maud. Thompson King, but. Here's Scaroni. A lick. Watch well from Ramzani. Driver to Mundy. And for the moment it is the Lions that are camped in their half. Long diagonal looking to try and pick out Dunn. Dunn to Thompson King. He floats it in towards the far post. It's headed up and over. It's headed up and over by... Jankovic. Ramzani. Redenton. It's forced to go long. It's done almost taken away with it. Again, the Lions try and go long again. With Logo, it's interesting. The Lions looking to go a bit more direct. Yeah, probably because of the, the pressure applied by Olympic. That's Scaroni. There's Driver. There's Maud. Scaroni again. Leck. Jankovic. Finds Beagley. De Vita coming short. There's De Vita. Switches it out to Thompson King. He's going back towards Driver Monday again. Here's Scaroni. De Vita. Is done. De Vita. 
Need to play it back there. Beagley fires it across. Well, good play from Olympic. They worked out really well. They found the space, but again, just in that final third, nothing happening. A wasted opportunity. Beagley works really hard to get down that flank. Just couldn't get the ball into the box. There's Broderick. The referee saying nothing in that foul off Scaroni. That one back well. Here is Jared. So much room now for the Lions. It's played back towards Jared. Jared into the box and he hits the crossbar. It's still alive though. And the volley from Intiknap goes wide. And really that attack comes from Jared. He intercepts the pass. In the middle of the park, he drives forward, he gets the ball back in the box. And you know, if that's, if that's Pengeli or Broderick or one of the attacking players for Lions, you would expect them to score, but big centre-half, Jared. Striking it well enough, but off the bar it goes. And there's Olympic caught on the counter themselves. There's Scaroni. Rod now driving forward. Can pick anybody out, Maud. Back to Devita. Devita helps it in. Lek plays it across. And Jankovic. There's Pengeli. And he gives it straight back to the Lions. I think looking for Dan, it's a nice touch from Brindle South. Just to help it away from Dan as he tries to get in behind. There's a long throw, it's headed away. Be a second attempt here at the throw. Nine minutes to go. Here live on FQ TV. Olympic battling to try and salvage something in this game as the Lions look to hold on. Defita brings it under control. Claims of a free kick. It's Hart Phillips with the clearance. Pon just wondering why well, that wasn't a foul. A little push from Devita. Change there is Redenton replaced from Carlos in these final minutes as Lions have to make a little bit of a defensive change. There is that long throw. It's helped on looking to fall for De Vita. Here's Scaroni. There's Monday. Monday out to Maud. Lions closing off their options. There's Driver. Nice pass from the captain. Thompson King trying to pick out Lake. Here is Monday. Drive up Monday again. There's Lugo. Scaroni. Zani strong in the challenge, comes away with it. Broderick. There's Broderick, the goal scorer. That's Ramzani on support.
Mount Phillips. Uh, Ramzani. And Ticknip driving forward. Got Broderick, the goal scorer, to his left. Broderick tries to get it in. Probably see it go for a corner. It referee's actually. And it's gone for a goal kick. Uh, Lionsman's he changed his mind again. It's gone for a corner now for the Lions. And that will allow them to waste some more time. Two minutes of normal time left to play here at Goodwin Park. Olympic. The Unable to challenge Pond and goal despite that pressure. There's the right foot delivery. It's all the way through and it might come to the volley and it is fired home. The substitute Carlos makes it 2-0 to the Lions. And that will probably be game over here at Goodwin Park. John Carlos, thundering past Lugo. It wasn't, the corner wasn't dealt with at all by Olympic. And Carlos is at home to put this game beyond any doubt. That goal coming at a really good time for the Lions because Olympic was starting to just creep into the game in the final few minutes. But a goal at the start of the half and a goal at the end of the half. We'll see the Lions go top of the table after round three. Providing there is no medical here from Olympic. There's a dipping shot from Dunn as well of the bar. Olympic will be ruining that penalty miss after 18 minutes from Leck. It could have been a completely different game if an Olympic side was holding on to a one goal lead. That's all if, buts and maybes. And it's Lions. Two goals to the good in the final minutes of this game here at Goodwin Park. There's Nello. And King trying to find Devita. Devita using his strength well. Ramzani knocking it up into the air. Devita is intercepted by Carlos. He's back with Carlos. It's given away though. Mankovic. There's Thompson King. Devita. Devita shapes onto the right foot, fires it across, it's spilled from Pond and helped away by Jared. Nello just not able to hit the target at all. There's Nello. Nello trying to actually win a corner, gets it across. And it's collected from Pond and he'll just waste a few extra seconds. Well, this is a this will go down as a fantastic result for Lions. It's always difficult when you come here to Goodwin Park to get a result. A 2 0 win. There's Leck. And Maud. Scaroni. Here's Mundy. There's De Vita, loses out to Rindle South. Nello looking to chase it down as Pond knocking it right back to his opposite number in Lugo. Here's Dunn, he's drifting into trouble. 
I'm trying to switch it out here to Maud. It's a fine delivery. Here's done again. Ramzani watching him. It is with Jackson King. Here's Leck. It's given away. Ramzani clears. It goes all the way through to Lugo. It is Olympic who travel to Wolves next. As they look to bounce back from this defeat. And it is full time here at Goodwin Park. A battling performance from Olympic. Was it enough as the Lions claim all three points? A uh, missed penalty in the first 45. Well, Olympic will probably rue that miss. And in the end, a comfortable victory for the Lions. It's finished here at Goodwin Park. Olympic nil. Lions 2.